If you're looking to create an Avada e-commerce website, basically just an e-commerce website built using the Avada theme, then uh, I think you're going to be pleasantly surprised. There's a lot of functionality built within the Avada theme, um, you know, which obviously is a WordPress theme. Uh, so once you have the Avada theme installed, you can create an e-commerce website that looks real nice like this, where you have, well, I mean, this is just a standard homepage, uh, but you got the products, um, you know, people can share stuff, see related products, all sorts of different features uh, that are built into Avado and you're creating an e-commerce website. Now, if you don't want to create one from scratch, you do have the option to just import one of their demo sites. So if you come over to Avada and then click websites, then you'll see they have a bunch of different templates that you can use here. And from here, if you there's categories on the left. So if you click shop, then these are all of the pre-built website templates that are for uh, building a uh, e-commerce website. So you can see we use this classic shop. You can see it says partial import. So if you preview this, <laughs> it looks quite a bit different. Uh, but even if you look at like, let's say we look at one of these products. Yeah, they've actually changed a bunch of stuff on here. But the cool thing is they rolled out this feature recently where you can customize the product page layout. You can select, like if you have a couple products that need to have a certain layout for the product page and then others that need a different one, you can do that uh, by product essentially. And you do that under, well, before we get to that, I just wanna wrap this up. So uh, if you find one of these that you like, like let's say you like this Avada Handmade, uh, then you can go ahead and import this demo. So that's what we did with the classic shop here. And then we just tweaked it for our own needs such that it looks the way we want it to look. But that way we didn't have to start from scratch and build everything from the bottom up. So extremely useful feature that's built into the Avada theme. Uh, so then if you want to edit the actual layout, there's this layout builder where you can create um, like, this is the global uh, layout, but you can just create one like product page content. And then when you create this, you'll be able to uh, essentially determine what's on this page. So the content is Well, we just need to create one of these blocks here first. Uh, but we can go into here and actually customize how these product pages are laid out. And you have essentially full control over the layout of these pages using this. Uh, so if you, if you click the Avada Builder, then Container, and then Elements, you'll see these are all WooCommerce um, options here, which I would recommend if you're going to use the Avada theme to build an e-commerce website, you definitely want to use WooCommerce because it's all built in and integrated. Uh, but you can have, you know, the product images and then you can have your reviews and then you can have the price and then the checkout button, the add to cart button. So you can customize this layout however you want. And then here you can select what pages. So if we want it to be on the products, then we could check this and that's going to add it to all of the products. Or again, you can use it on specific products. So if there's ones that you want to use a specific layout on, you can do that. So really powerful feature here. We're not actually using this, so I'm just going to get rid of it for right now. Um, and then there's also a lot of customizations you can do to the checkout page just built in. So this is a single page checkout. You can also have multi-step checkout where the first step is adding billing details and then they go through the shipping and then the checkout, which is great if you're going to use abandoned cart email follow up. So essentially somebody enters their information, then they get to the next page, which is shipping information. If they get there and then they leave, then you already have their name and email address and you can send a follow up email saying, hey, we noticed you left without checking out. Here's the stuff in your cart. Let us know if, you know, 
go ahead and check out essentially. Uh, but you can see this stuff so built in here where they have, you, you know, you can uh, contact support. So if you go to the global options, which is just under Avada options, and you scroll down, there's this WooCommerce section. So this is that message I was telling you about. This is just built right in. You can have a second follow-up message, um, just depending on what you want to have there. But there's all sorts of functionality. Like I was talking about the one-page checkout. So here's the one-page checkout. So you could switch that off, and then it'll be a multi-page checkout. You can enable the order notes. You can have uh, uh, icons in the menu. There's tons of stuff here. So I'm not going to go into all of this, but then there's also the Avada styling. So if you know where this stuff is at, then you can come through and figure out, you know, what needs to be changed in here for your specific needs. So I hope that was helpful just to give you an understanding of what it's like when you're building an uh, e-commerce website in Avada. Obviously, I could make a two-hour video about all the different features, but I just wanted to give you a quick overview. So if there's anything you did have questions about, don't hesitate to reach out. You can just drop your questions in the comments section below. I'll be sure to get back to them there. And until next time, take care.